Hello gamers, welcome to another episode of Gamers United. We are playing Journey today. Um, I tried doing a stream last night through Xbox, it was really weird. So I think what I'm just going to do is just get a capture card and go from there. That way I can record all the way to PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3, Xbox, and Xbox 360, and obviously Xbox One. Um, I do have some PC games, I do have some emulators. Um, I wanted to play a game I've never played before, and I saw that I had downloaded this, and that it was between this and the Uncharted series, and I thought, you know, I've seen playthroughs of the Uncharted series. I've seen my friends play it. I played a little bit myself. Um, but I've never seen um, this before. Now, a long time ago, back before... Well, I, should, I shouldn't say before. Back when Jack Jacksepticeye, or Sean McLaughlin, he... Um, he had played this a long time ago, way before he started um, doing face cam. Now, that tells you how long ago, like when he first started, um, he had played this. And at the time, I just, eh, I don't want to. Um, but I saw that the PS4 version had come out and the graphics were okay, you know, that they've been improved. I figured why not give it a shot. Um, also, um, at the end of the video, um, I'm going to talk about a little sensitive subject. Um, but I don't want to ruin the video right at the beginning and ruin everyone's mood. So we'll just save that to the end. Um, but the reason I mentioned Jacksepticeye is because we are pretty much a group YouTube channel, a fan-based group YouTube channel, um, I noticed that, you know, he has hit, recently hit 24 million subscribers, um, in the very short time he started, and he has grown as a person so much, oh my goodness, and I was with him pretty much from the start, um, me personally, he's one of my heroes, I do me personally um i looked up to him as an idol um and i you know i'm not the only one but he has touched so many people's hearts you know people have made songs you know all the way um come closer this world is mine um he's inspired so much fan art it is incredible the artistic talent that is just in these people. I'm happy I can make stick figures. Um, and just seeing what these people can do with their hands, with computers, with ink, chalk, oils. It's incredible. Um, people have written stories. Uh, little fan fictions here and there. It's absolutely enthralling. Just, this came out of your head? Oh my goodness. And it's all because he has inspired them so much. Um, that's what Gamers United is about, is me and a couple of others, we got together, and it's like, let's make a YouTube channel. Um, I am actually the first, the newest member to the YouTube streaming gaming ch area. I have always wanted to do it, but now I'm able to. Um, I, you know... King Zoidberg, he does tribute videos, as you've seen on the channel. Uh, Matt Gaming 3 he does streams. Um, Jack EXE, he does Roblox and Gmod videos. Exoqueen, she does streams. She is a highly popular streamer on Mixer. She does mainly Xbox One. Um, I will leave all of those people, all of my co co-hosts links in the description below so you can go check out their channels or their streams. 
Um, Exo Queen is a personal friend of mine that I met in college. And I was like, girl, why are you always playing games? Like, oh my goodness, you've got to be tired. And she goes, oh, I stream. And I never thought to look it up. Well, it's hard when you're working and you're not able to listen or watch. Um, and then we were playing Minecraft the other day. And, you know, she's talking and her energy is so high. And it reminds me of Jack. His energy is so high. And I give credit to every single YouTuber you know, they have such high energy and they're always smiling, they're always laughing, they are giving 200% all the time. And they record multiple videos in a day. And it is a constant thing and it's just, it's tiring. I did six videos in a row, I recorded six videos in a row and by the end I'm like, wow, I'm exhausted. Kudos to Markiplier, Jack, Game Grumps, Crank Gameplays, um, Al Alonzo Lerone, Liza, um, I could go on for hours listing YouTubers. Every single YouTuber that is out there, whether they are just starting or they've been on the channel, their YouTube for years and years and years, kudos to you guys because you have been doing this for so long and look how successful you are. People look up to you so much and just the communities are so supportive of each other and they care like it is genuine people it's you don't get fake ass people and it's just especially during this time it it has a little bit of hope um i'm just i'm never not amazed. I am always amazed at people being true people and caring about one another and supporting each other and giving constructive criticism and saying this is good but next time do ABC. You know and not just trash talk it or anything. It's it's incredible and Sometimes just a simple, um, just a simple, um, hey, that's really good. Or, hey, how are you doing today? It just, it can change. Um, yeah, it's been, it's been incredible. And we did this ourselves. We weren't asked to create Gamers United. I know there are a lot of channels out there that have Gamers United or a, you know, variation of the name. But I don't think just having a single name or having a unique name defines the channel. I think it's about the content and the community that they build and that we work together. Um, we have um, Zoidberg who plays on Xbox. He just has an Xbox. We have Matt Gaming 3 has a P PS4. Exo Queen just has an Xbox. Um, Jack EXE. He has, um, he mainly does PC, and I do PlayStation and Xbox, um, and my emulators. And it's just, when we come together, you know, that's why our sim, our logo is what it is. Is you have the blue for the PlayStation, the green for the Xbox, and the black for PC. And that's why we're Gamers United, we have come together and hopefully we can make a difference even on a small scale like we have like Mark, Jack, Bob, Wade, um, Ethan, you know all those guys and you know I always look on the videos 
to see if there's comments because I want all of you guys to know that we are here for you. Um, if you need to talk about anything, or if you just want to say hi, if you write hi, we'll write back hi. You know, how was your day? You know, we'll, we'll have a conversation. Um, I just, I don't want to, f I don't want our viewers, our subscribers to feel like they can't talk to us. You know, we may be in different parts of the state, the world, you know. I want you to know that we are there for you. Um, and especially, it's, it's more difficult for me as I have been elected the leader of Gamers United. So I make sure I create the semi-normal schedule. Um, I make sure everyone's on top of their, you know, on top of the schedule, on top of their videos, and make sure that they're doing okay. Like Jack EX, he, he, um, he almost got hit by a car. So his hands are a little bit messed up. You know, he just, had, he's, other than just a few scrapes, he's fine. He's okay. So he can't really hold a controller or play with the mouse and a keypad right now. Um, so I've picked up his Fridays. Um, you know, I just, I want to make sure that not only are they doing okay, but I want to make sure you guys are doing okay too. Let us start a new journey. Oops, I forgot to silence my phone. That is my fault. I don't know if you could hear that or not. Go. Oh boy. Okay, it's on vibrate now. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, wow. That's pretty. Oh, the sun is so bright, it hurts. Graves, maybe? I'm guessing we were the little shooting star. Oh, that's so weird. Oh, this is a cool way to show you the tutorial. Look at our little legs. Oh, wow, look at this. You step in the sand and it kind of goes poof, poof, poof. Just like, um, like in real world. And you see the little sand divot of where you run and it stays in place. You can actually see the path you take. Ah. <laughs> That's cool. I just drew a penis in the sand. I'm sorry, I'm a five-year-old. Oh my goodness. So the right stick is also camera. But also, if you saw the first command, you tilt the Xbox controller from horizontal and vertical to change the camera. And the more it's tilted, the faster it goes. I'm sorry if um, that made you all dizzy. I just thought that was really cool. And then your are Wow, they put a lot of thought into the character movement. You don't just gallivant up the hill like it's no big deal. It's You're struggling up the hill. Because sand's continuously moving. That is neato. Ooh, shiny. 
Nice. So I have a feeling we have to get to that little light. Oh, look, there's a little light telling us where we gotta go next. Can we interact? Is there... Oh, you sit down! I hit the uh, options button, and you just sit. Okay. It's almost like you sank into the sand. Can you... He gets up. And there's sand around your clothes. Oh, that's so cool. the circle button and it did a thing. Don't go. Okay, I hit all the other buttons. Oh! 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 So I hit the center pad and it brought us to this. What does options? Chapter select and camera default. Interesting. Oh. Yeah, we're, we, we're not going to do anything. We're just going to leave it on default. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, we're going to resume. Sorry about that. Oh, do you slide down it? Oh, you slide down it. That's so cool. I wonder about these graves. I, I, they have to be graves. That's the only thing I can think of. And the controller is pulsing. Oh, this is weird. There's a lot of them. What was this? Okay. Oh, it's just stones. Oh, you automatically jump. Look at you hop. Hop, hop, hop. Oh, what's this? I think that's how we flew in. Those little marks. <gasps> we have a little tassel. <gasps> it's a decorative tassel. Hold the X button. <gasps> he could fly! Or jump. Oh, it's getting bigger. We have the power to jump very high. One, two, three, four. Is anything changing? I can't tell if it's changing or not. We can finally fly! Ah, uh, you know what? I probably have to stay on there. It's a one-time use. Because I can't do it again. Okay. <gasps> you just come back here and they automatically replenish it. That's neat. And there's another spot. It's like we're following the little scarves. Scarf? I don't know. Uh, scabbard, I believe it's called. It's like a baby scabbard. <gasps> yeah, they were pl- Ah! Well, ain't this neat? Whee! Oh, wow, we went far. Oh, my goodness. Our journey looks really fast. I mean, there's the mountain. That seems really short. I really hope this isn't a short game. I know, let's go see what's over here. Boop! Oh, and you do a little dive roll! Oh, how cute! This is actually really cute. Whee! Oh, you didn't do it this time.
so what I'm guessing is this used to be a large community something happened and the desert said screw you I'm taking back over I mean if we think about it anything that's left abandoned for too long mother nature takes it back <laughs> bitch I was here first mm -hmm. Seems like a little barrel roll. And then maybe a war came out? Something bad happened to where all these grave sites happened. Um, I'm never one for going straight for the directive. Unless there's nothing else to do. So I'm going to be Nebby. And see what this is. Oh, look at the sun. Oh! It said no. Oh! New face band. Look! It's all dirty. We're all dirty. So pretty much it's like a game sandstorm. Like, like the edge of the map where there's an invisible barrier. Oh, hey, 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 there's a shiny here. Woo! I want the sh- More graves? How do I... <gasps> Wait. Oh! Oh my god. What'd I do? Okay, that's weird. So I got my flight back. Um, maybe this is a town hall? Town center? That's an awfully big bridgeway, though. Because there's... Maybe this was a temple? Because usually temples are big, but usually... Not like that. Oh, they're trapped! These guys are trapped! Aww. Okay, that didn't do anything. That's really sad. There's some over there. So this is why they introduced the jump mechanic. I want to see what's on top. Oh, but there's another one over here. Sorry, I have really bad, like, I get distracted very easily with shinies. Look, there's some empty over here. There's some trapped over <gasps> Do I have to free the ribbons? Oops, wrong button. Oh, that was, that was not okay. Yeah, because there's some in here. Poor little guys. So... Maybe we have to hit that center one first. Or was I just not on the right angle? It's hard when you only have one game speed, though. It's like Silent Hill, slow and stop. Ah! Oh, oh, it's a thing. It's a bigger jump. Our scabbard is bigger. So maybe it's more powerful jump? I don't know.
collecting the power-ups so we are able to jump from this main pedestal to the second one. That is my guess. Where is it? Here it is. Look at me, it's even longer. Woo! So in theory, oh, oops, that was the thing that happened. So in theory, I should be able to jump. Oh, I don't even have to jump down. Do we have arms? I don't think we even have arms. What is this? <gasps> Hold the circle button. Oh, is this what this does? Oh, I did a thing. Release the... Release the fabric scraps. That was cool. I was able to freaking fly. And they follow me. They like center around me. Except they dissipate when I get to there, so what gives? I don't know. Okay, ready? Oh, that was, that was an, okay, okay. That was lame. Let's try this again, guys. Whee! Oh, that was kick-ass. <gasps> What's this do? Oops. Oh. I have to walk by it. Oh, I just saw it. What? Oh, it's story time. So apparently this light reaches the heavens. Or the stars. Things that fly. Things that grow. <gasps> it's us! And the little mysterious light that gives us our scabbards. Tree of life? Maybe? I have a feeling our journey is learning how our people began and left. <gasps> I see something at the end of the tunnel. I hope it's not a train, because that would really suck. Okay, I'm gonna see how powerful our jump is. Look at this! You see 